Hi again, I'm Scott Coletti with your Lobo Football Camp report here in Ruidoso. This report brought to you by La Quinta Inn and Suites at Ruidoso Downs in Ruidoso, New Mexico. Lobo fans receive discounted rates all year long. Call them for details. The University of New Mexico football team continues its preseason camp in Ruidoso as it gets ready for the season opener against Colorado State on September 3rd at University Stadium. The success of the offensive line will heavily relate to the success of the Lobo offense in 2011. UNM averaged just 265 yards a game in total offense a year ago, including 108 a game rushing. This season, the Lobos are expecting bigger gains. While depth may be a concern, the talent of the line has beefed up. Sophomore Dylan Farrell, who's on the Remington Award watch list for the top center in the nation, had a strong freshman campaign. He's expecting more success his second time around. Good, good, good. Well, you know, Coach, uh, Coach Hud's going to move me wherever he wants me to play. And, uh, you know, I, I have to play wherever the team needs me to play. So, you know, it's, it's an honor to be mentioned on the Remington list, and it's, it's a great privilege. But, you know what, if I have to play left tackle, that's, that's great. And if we get to a bowl game with that, that's even better. Freshman Lamar Broughton has made an impression at center so far during camp. I love how the offensive line is going. Uh, we're really working hard with the film room, working hard on the practice field. We've been hitting the sleds hard. We've been working on the boards, and I really, I really appreciate the effort that uh, my teammates are getting. Junior Corian Chambers comes to UNM by way of Arizona Western Junior College. He also comes with a heavy desire to win. Uh, well, we're just trying to stay healthy and, and practice hard. Just stay healthy. You know, we, uh, we, we don't have that much depth, but with the people we got, I believe we can get the job done. Ron Hudson is in his first season as offensive line coach for the Lobos. Hudson is a teacher personified. I couldn't be prouder of him. I could not be prouder of him. We've got a great group of guys, a lot of young guys, you know. We've got a couple of seniors that have been here for a long time, and they're doing a great job of leading us. Uh, but we've got so many young guys that have stepped up and they continue to work. And, uh, and, and like, you, you know, when you talk to these guys, they're buying into what we're teaching. I mean, they're, they're, they're humble, they're hardworking. Uh, you know, when they don't do it the right way, you can tell it hurts them, it bothers them, because they want to please. And you, as a coach, you can't ask for more than that. Lobos head coach Mike Loxley likes what he sees so far out of the offensive line, but he knows the offensive line still has a long way to go. Ron's done a great job with that group. Uh, the biggest thing that I see out of it is it's such a cohesion uh, amongst them, and uh, and that starts with the, with, with Hud and his meeting rooms and, and what he demands. And so, you know, I've been uh, impressed thus far with the uh, with the work they've done. We obviously still have a lot of work to get done uh, here with a few or uh, a week and a half left of camp. And so, I just want to see them continue to improve. With the Lobo football team in Ruidoso, sponsored by La Quinta and Suites at Ruidoso Downs, I'm Scott Galati for Lobo TV.